What's up everybody, it's me E-Man from E-Man's Movie Reviews. In my last video, I proposed a theory that suggested that Avengers 4 is not about time travel. I also suggested that if that theory proved to be true, we might have already seen the trailer for Avengers 4. Well today, I'm going to explain exactly what I mean by that, coming up next. Now I know some of you may not follow all of the news about these movies, so I'm gonna start off by giving you all some background information. That way we can all be on the same page. After Infinity War released, people realized that a lot of scenes in the trailers and TV spots weren't in the movie. We would see things like Bruce Banner and Wakanda fixing up the Hulkbuster, or the biggest standout being the ending shot of the Avengers running to battle with Hulk in the background. Besides that, there's another very specific scene with Tony Stark that has some really strange stuff going on. That scene is one I'll really need you all to give me your input on because I think it's a really important scene for Avengers 4. I'll dig deeper into this a little later, but I first want to share with you all what the Russo brothers had to say about the Infinity War trailer and those scenes that didn't make the movie. They addressed the seemingly misleading trailer scenes by saying the following. We use all the material that we have at our disposal to create a trailer. I think audiences are so predictive now that you have to be very smart about how you craft a trailer because an audience can watch a trailer and basically tell you what's going to happen in the film. So at our disposal are lots of different shots that aren't in the movie that we can manipulate through CG to tell a story that we want to tell specifically for the purpose of the trailer and not for the film. All right, so we know that the Russo brothers intentionally put scenes into the trailer for the purpose of telling a story. So could it be that the Infinity War trailer may be also telling a story for Avengers 4? I mean, the Russo brothers did shoot Infinity War and Avengers 4 back to back after all. So they would be in the perfect position to have everything laid out early and direct or misdirect us however they want. Okay, that's enough background information. In order for us to examine whether or not we've already seen Avengers 4 trailer footage, we're going to have to look at two main clues in the Infinity War trailer. Each clue is going to be based on an Avengers 4 theory. I'm going to start off with the more popular theory, which suggests that Avengers 4 will have the original Avengers doing some time traveling. That theory came about when set photos leaked, showing the now current Avengers visiting key moments that appear to be from the past. There are a couple of versions to the time travel theory, but the one I'm going to focus on is the time travel theory that states that the Avengers will travel back in time to prevent Thanos from acquiring each Infinity Stone. So going off that time travel theory, we can look back at these key moments in the Infinity War trailer with a very different perspective. The Russo brothers said that they use special effects to alter the trailer to tell a story. One thing we noticed in hindsight was that Thanos did not have the same Infinity Stones in the trailer as he did in the movie. On one hand, that could have been brilliantly done in order to hide the fact that Thanos would acquire all the stones before we all got a chance to go see the movie. On the other hand, if the time travel theory is true, and if the Avengers will be on a quest of preventing Thanos from getting all the stones, then isn't it possible that these scenes of Thanos with a different number of stones could actually be what happens in Avengers 4? And if the time travel theory is true, that the Avengers will be revisiting past events, then wouldn't that possibly explain why Thanos has less stones in this Wakanda scene? All right, now let's shift our attention to another clue in the Infinity War trailer. In order to examine this one, we'll need to base this on the alternative theory for Avengers 4. 
In this other theory, it is suggested that instead of time travel, the Avengers will use Tony Stark's barf technology and maybe the reality stone to defeat Thanos. Now, if that sounds confusing or if you're new to my channel, then I highly recommend that you go back and check out my previous theory videos to get more specific details about my theory. I'll put links in the description to help you out. Anyway, let's focus on the scene with Tony Stark that I mentioned earlier. I personally think that this is the biggest clue we have of seeing a scene from Avengers 4. I don't know about you, but this scene bothered me a little bit more than the other scenes that didn't make the cut in Infinity War. I mean, do you all see what's wrong here? Pay attention to the background. Doctor Strange, Bruce Banner, and Wong all appear to be frozen. Why is Tony the only one able to move? Well, in my previous theory, I suggested that Tony was going to use his barf technology in Avengers 4 as a way to stop Thanos, or maybe just to learn about the Infinity Stones. With the characters frozen in the background like that, it would appear that Tony is running some type of barf simulation just like he did in Civil War. Maybe Tony is revisiting the scene using his barf technology to find or investigate a clue in Avengers 4. What do you all make of this brief clip? And do you think it's Tony's barf tech at work or maybe the Avengers are just playing a friendly game of red light, green light? Now, I understand that this could be a stretch and that's totally fine. If some of you have not caught on by now, or if you're new to my channel, I think it's just really fun to speculate about these type of things and then talk about them with all of you. The way I see it, we've got some really interesting scenes in the trailers that could mesh very well with some of these theories or these rumors. For example, some of the leaked set photos and concept art suggest that we'll actually see the Hulk again in Avengers 4. Well, if the time travel or barf theory proved to be true, that would explain why we would see Hulk and Wakanda in Avengers 4. Maybe that'll also explain other random scenes that just so happen to show the surviving Avengers too. Now, I can also be very realistic here. I've seen a lot of trailers in my life and it's not uncommon to see a scene be cut out. It's also pretty obvious that Marvel has a ton of money, but I would think that devoting a bunch of time to shoot this or that extra scene just for a trailer seems a little bit much. I also just wouldn't put it past the Russo brothers to sneak in some future footage of Avengers 4 into an Avengers Infinity War trailer. I mean, it would be pretty cool if they did. So what do you all think? Do you think that the Russo brothers have already snuck in some Avengers 4 scenes into the Infinity War trailer? Could it be that we've already seen some scenes from Avengers 4? Let me know what you all think in the comments down below and let's talk about it. I'd love to hear your ideas and your thoughts. Thank you so much for joining me today. I really appreciate you all taking the time to watch my videos. If you're new to my channel, please don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. I've got more videos and reviews to do for you all. And until next time, see you guys later.